What's going on, you guys? Mr. Allen here. We need to determine where the graph of f of x is increasing and decreasing. All right, for intervals of increasing and decreasing, we need to think about this graph from left to right, kind of like a roller coaster, okay? So the first part here, we are decreasing. Until we get to this point, then it's going to turn and we're going to go into an increasing mode. Then we're going to turn again and we're going to head back to decreasing. So I'm to say where this is happening. So let's start with our decreasing right here. So the far left side of my graph would be negative infinity. Then I'm decreasing until my X value is negative three. So I'm gonna put negative three here. All right, then I go into increasing mode, right? So we're gonna put increasing. Where is that occurring on this graph? Between negative three and negative one, the graph is increasing. So from negative three to negative one, all right. Then I turn again at that negative one and I'm gonna continue decreasing forever and ever and ever with this graph here. So all the way to the right is gonna be positive infinity. So we'll have a little union here and then I'll write it down here. We're gonna go from negative one to positive infinity. It's going to be decreasing. So we have two intervals of decreasing and one right in between that is increasing. That is it. This is interval notation. That's dope. See you guys later.